Good morning guys, how are you? I missed you too much. Now let's start with a new lesson which is lesson 31 about polygons. What is meant by a polygon? A polygon is a closed figure of three sides or more that are straight lines. Okay? Now, a polygon has a number of vertices size and angles here the dots on this polygon are called the vertices of this polygon now the straight lines of this polygon are called the sides of the polygon but here the interior angles which is which are located inside the polygon are called the angles of the polygon for example this dot B is called vertex B. The straight line of this polygon is side AB. Here, this angle is called angle C. Now, how many vertices does this polygon have? It has three vertices, three sides, and three angles. Now, how can we differentiate by if this figure is a polygon or not? Here we have a closed figure of all its sides are straight, so it is a polygon. But here we have in this figure, one of its sides is a curved line. A polygon does not have a, a curved line, so it is not a polygon. Here, the third figure is open. The polygon should be closed. So it is not a polygon because it is open. Okay? Now, I will name the vertices of the polygon. Here we have vertex A, B, C. Look how I named I named them A, B, and C. Here, the three vertices of this polygon. Now, the sides of the polygon A, B, C are A, B. Here, A, B, B, C, and A, C. Now, the angles. Here, angle A. Here, angle B. And the third one is angle B. Here angle A, angle C, and the third angle is B. Now you should know the parts of this polygon. Now, look, we should, when we write the sides, you should put the brackets. Eh? Each two points are looked are joined together is called the side of the polygon. Now, here we have the symbol of the angle. We put it above the, the angle, okay? Here's the, this is the symbol of the angle. Now, we have a remark here. The side, what is the side of each polygon? It is a line segment because it is ended with two points, for example, A, B, and it starts with A and ended with B. Now we have a new point about the right angle. The right angle of any vertex represented by L shape. Look here, we have L shape. When it is formed with L shape, so, it is a right angle. Now we have here another right angle represented by letter L. Okay? When, when we name the right angles, it is formed by a big letter L. Okay? Or you can use what? A T square. A T square, يعني مثلث اللي له right angle. We can put it here. If it form a big letter L on the T square, 
then it is the right angle okay now which angles are right in this polygon B and the Q here P and the Q I have a note here when you name any polygon you you start from any point eh? but in the form of the uh, of the the hands of the clock okay for example M and PQ you don't name it like this M and QP eh? so to name this figure you should name the polygon like that M and PQ the four points should be consecutive consecutively and let me know what about them okay okay my students good luck and stay at home and study well okay B C and A C now the angles here angle A here angle B and the third one is angle B here angle A angle C and the third angle is B now you should know the parts of this polygon now look we should when we write the sides you should put the brackets eh? each two points are look, are joined together is called the side of the polygon now here we have the symbol of the angle we put it above the the angle okay here's the this is the symbol of the angle now we have a remark here the side what is the side of each polygon it is a line segment because it is ended with two points for example a b and it starts with a and ended with b now we have a new point about the right angle the right angle of any vertex represented by L shape look here we have L shape when it is formed with L shape so it is a right angle now we have here another right angle represented by letter L okay when, when we name the right angles it is formed by a big letter L okay or you can use what a T square a T square يعني مثلث اللي له right angle هذه الأدوات الهندسية we can put it here if it form a big letter L on the T square then it is a right angle okay now which angles are right in this polygon B and the Q here P and the Q I have a note here when you name any polygon you you start from any point eh, but in the form of the uh, of the the hands of the clock okay for example angle okay now which angles are right in this polygon B and the Q here P and the Q I have a note here when you name any polygon you you start from any point eh, but in the form of the uh, of the the hands of the clock okay for example M and PQ you don't name it like this M and QP eh? so to name this figure you should name the polygon like that M and PQ the four points should be consecutive consecutively and let me know what about them okay 
Okay, my students, good luck. Yes. Stay at home and study well. Okay?